Your compressor's motor uses two carbon brushes to conduct electricity to the armature. The brushes conduct electricity to the armature through its commutator. The carbon brush will wear down over time from rubbing against the rotating commutator and will need to be replaced. Worn brushes can cause excessive sparks around the commutator. The sparks can also be caused by a damaged armature, so you will want to carefully inspect both if sparks are present. Replacing the carbon brushes is a repair that you can do yourself, and I'm going to show you how. Before you perform any work on your air compressor, make sure that it's unplugged and you've drained any air from the tank. I'll begin by removing the motor housings. They're held in place with a series of screws. With the screws removed, now use a screwdriver to gently pry the housings apart. Now I have access to the brushes, I can remove the old ones. The brush lead is crimped to a wire next to the brush holder. I want to cut that wire as close to the crimp connector as possible. To remove the brush, I'll insert a 90 degree pick through the brush spring. I'll pull it out of the way, remove the brush, and then I'll lay the spring over the other side of the brush holder. And I'll repeat this process on the other brush. Now I can install the new brush. I'll pull the brush spring back, install the brush, place the brush spring back on top of the brush, and now I need to install the brush lead to the wire. The kit comes with a couple of crimp connectors. I'll place the connector over the wire and insert the brush lead. I want the two wires next to each other inside the connector. Then I'll use a pair of pliers to crimp the connector together. And again, I repeat this on the other side. 